Howdy folks, this is Checkers, and this, well, this is East Shade, a game that I saw just released on Steam, and I thought it was interesting and that I might bring it to your attention. It is self-described as an open-world adventure game in which you play a painter. I've played just a very little bit of it. It has a somewhat Morrowindian start to it. Now, I will say there is one thing that drags it down a little bit for me being left-handed is that there is no way to remap any keys whatsoever. Um, so I'm playing with W, A, S, and D, which makes my poor old arthritic hands hurt, but we'll see how that goes. Let's take a look into East Shade. Forgive an old woman, but I forgot your name. What was it again? Checkers. Would you mind getting my book from the sleeping quarters? It would spare my bones the trip. It's called Great Voyages. No problem at all, ma'am. Let me just whip on back in there. Let's take a look at our journal. Help an old woman. The old woman traveling with us asked me to fetch her book from the sleeping quarters. Property of Clara S. If found, please return to Port of Lindo. Great voyages. The seas of the north are widely unexplored. Researchers predict these waters are expansive, and small expeditions have revealed numerous islands filled with diverse life and communities. Due to the unpredictable and violent nature of these waters, many exploration ships have been lost while attempting to form new contacts and carry out scientific research. All eyes on the horizon. There we are. Thank you very much. I've read this old book many times. Seems I find something new each read. And no matter how many times I've read it, it never fails to get me excited for adventure. Are you the adventuring type? Why, yes, actually, I am. Ah, after my own heart. I've had a lifetime of it, believe it or not. If you're sticking around in East Shade, maybe I'll tell you all about it sometime. Captain Elona told me we'll be landing in Lindo shortly. I think we're all antsy to arrive. Topics. You've just learned about a new topic. You can now inquire about this topic using the Pick Topic option when it's presented. Not everyone has something to say about every topic. Hello. Good book? Looks like a good book. I'll leave you to it then. I've never been to East Shed. I've heard wonderful things about it. Did you know that the people there used to cover their mouths with garments? Really? I've heard that since gone out of style. Quite a strange fashion fad if you ask me. As long as Ishe doesn't rock like this ship, I will love it. What do you know about Lindo? It's the quaint little seaside town we'll be landing in. It's one of the many gems of the country, I hear. Alright, well, bye-bye. <sighs> Almost there. We can only hope. Oh, that did not sound good. Well, that is a problem. Did I ever tell you about the trip your father and I took to East Shade? Tell me again. Out of all the trips we took, that one was my favorite. You know, if you're ever looking for painting inspiration, 
I know, Mom. Tell me you'll visit it one day. Promise you'll go. I promise, Mom. To think of you exploring East Shade. It makes me so happy. I know you'll find inspiration there. What an adventure you'll have. Listen, there are some places you absolutely mustn't miss. Be sure to paint the giant tree. I remember it like it was yesterday. How will I know which tree? You won't miss it. Trust me. And the Tiffmore Bluffs. The lovely sky country. I can picture you there now, an easel set, and you making a beautiful painting. Those open skies and endless seas would move any artist. Okay, I will. And the city. There's a magnificent building in the center. From the very top floor, you can see the whole town and more. You won't be able to resist taking out your brushes. Uh, soon. You'll be there soon. You should get some rest, Mom. Mother's last wishes. You've woken. Do you remember what happened? I, I was traveling on a ship. It collided with the reef. I'm glad your memory's intact. You washed up on this beach just a short while after the ship sank. One doesn't last long in water this cold. Did everyone else make it? From what I've heard, you were the only passenger misplaced during the wreck. The others are safe in town. Where are we? East Shade, of course. Specifically, my home. I usually don't take visitors. But in this case, I can hardly blame you for floating in unannounced. Did any of my possessions float in? Only your reason. Don't forget to take it when you leave. Even the frigid tide couldn't bring you to part from it. It must mean a great deal to you. I won't forget. I was about to head into town to share news of your survival. You should go there and let them know yourself. It's just up the path. Thank you for helping me. On your way, then. You haven't created any paintings or canvases yet. When you do create a canvas, this is where you'll find it. Inventory, equipment, drinks, books. And our journal. Very pretty, very easy to get distracted. There's a tower over there. A stick. Oh, there's something, the symbol, the yellow symbol must mean something we can interact with. Maybe for pigment? Let's grab what we can. Lindo. Inspiration. Making paintings drains inspiration. 
gain inspiration by exploring new places and trying new things. Hello. Oh, it's Bird. you! You're on the ship. What happened to you? So this is Aaliyah. I washed up in a beach cave. Oh, thank goodness. We thought you were lost. Oh, what a horrible experience. I'm so glad to see you're safe. What brought you to Eastshade, anyway? My mother loved it here. Very adventurous of you. I came to visit my family. You look like you could use a nice cup of tea. This flavor is a bit strong for some people, but the effects can be lifted with a sip of water from your water skin. Thank you. Our captain is in a terrible state. I suppose that's to be expected. She won't even leave the dock. Perhaps it would console her to know that we all survived. You should speak with her. Where are you staying? My family lives here in Lindo, so I'll be staying with them. If you find that night is coming and you're in need of a place to stay, you should check the inn. You'll be comfortable there. It gets cold around here at night. You shouldn't be out without a proper coat. All right, I'm going to say take care. And we are going to take a moment To just bring some things down a little bit. I know my voice is soft. I had thought that the master volume would be enough. Okay. There we go. Sorry, I don't like to do that in the middle of our adventures, but once in a while it feels a little necessary. Are you gonna make a circle back this way? No? Yes, maybe? Hi! Aren't I good at flying? You are awesome at flying. I can do anything as long as I put my mind to it! You go, Lenny. Hey, are you an artist? Hey, you have an easel! Are you an artist? Why, yes, I am. So am I! Do you want to see what I made? I'd love to. Look! Wow, you worked really hard on this. It took all day. But I want to make my next one even better. What should I do? Hmm. You want to start with a nice canvas. But I don't know how to make a canvas. That makes two of us. So let's make it together. All right! You're a nice artist after all. Well, thank you. We need to collect boards and fabric. I know where some boards are. Follow me. Did you see when it ran a reef? I've never seen anything like that. Terrible waste of a good ship. And it went down so quickly. It's amazing anyone made it out of that. Now we just need the fabric. Okay. I don't know where to find that. Maybe we should ask someone. Okay. Let's go ask someone. Are you gonna come with me? Let's keep going. Okay. She's coming, so... Do you know about fabrics there, sir, ma'am? Alright, well, you know who might have fabrics is uh, sailors, right? For sale. Sailcloth, that sort of thing. Maybe this person right here. No? No. 
Oh, here's something. Hello! Uh, so you've survived too. That means only one of us has been lost at sea. Who was lost? Who? Only the most important one of us all, Annabelle! Your ship? Annabelle, she doesn't sound familiar. Doesn't sound... I see. She carries you across the oceans and you don't even learn her name. Annabelle! My ship! My wooden, sea-loving daughter! Killed by the damned reefs when we came into this miserable town. I'm very sorry about your ship, but you should take comfort in knowing that she gave her life to save everyone else. Kind of you to say so, but kindness does nothing to bring sweet Annabelle back to me. What will you do now? I imagine I'll be spending the rest of my days mourning Annabelle, sitting here, dreaming of a world where she wasn't destroyed and people actually remember her name. I'm sorry I didn't remember. Off with you. Trade your life for hers. Okay. Now leave me be. Well, I think we got some cloth, kid. So we have everything we need now, right? We can make a canvas from this stuff? Sure, let's give it a whirl. Uh, if you were a canvas, where would you go? No paintings or canvases. How about here? Open your crafting box. Sure. Is that this? No. Um. Oh, that's that. Okay. So, we have... Okay... Could you paint something? I want to watch a real artist. Okay, but we should probably get more cloth so we can make one for you too. Because I think we have enough to make two. You see any other, uh... Cloth around here? Holler. Maybe there's some more boxes. Let's check this out. There we go. And a cat. Okay, well, everything is perfect now, kid. We've got cats. Um, let's make you a canvas, too. Okay, um... I don't know how to make a painting. Let's, let's paint a cat. We'll paint... A cat and that ship will frame that ship in there like that. Uh, here, select the canvas. Okay. Drag to adjust cropping. I really would like to get all of that in there. But then we lose focus on the cat, so let's let's do what's important here. That's getting the cat in this picture. Right there. How do we make it go? No, that, that zoomed us in or something. Enter E E. Okay. E did our thing. We certainly did, Sanja. Here you go. Yes! I'm going to use this for Miss Nika's next painting. She loves art so much. Hey, Miss Nika loves art like us. She always likes my paintings. I bet she likes yours too. She really likes the eclipse. You should draw her that. Okay. Oh, well, there it, it was there and now it's gone. Thank you, kitty. I'd bring you some treats if I knew where to find some. We're gonna get some more boards here. And some more cloth. Hi there. We've had quite a few shipwrecks here. There's a reef surrounding the bay and that's what does it. It shouldn't slow down traffic too much though. I'm just glad you all made it. Well thanks, Doric. It was really very lucky. I work on the docks almost every day. If you ever have any questions about Lindau, come on over. And I'll do my best to help. 
Well, thanks, Doric. What can we talk about? Do you know where I could find fabric? Fabric? We go through loads of it. Here, these lengths are defective for shipping, but will perhaps serve your purposes. Thanks, Doric. Take care. Okay. So we could make another canvas. No, we don't have enough boards yet. Okay. What about no? Those are still good. We need broken boxes for canvas. We can jump a little bit. It's really quite peaceful. The voices are a little loud. I might tone that volume down. But... As for a world... Watch me soar like a bird! What is this? Okay. Hi! You having a problem there? Who's there? Nika? Is that you? Uh, nope. You must be one of the tourists. Terrible about the sinking and all that. Glad you're okay. Yada, yada, etc. Uh, but will you go get Nika, the innkeeper? I need help. It looks like you just might. I'll go get her. Brilliant. I'll wait here. Yeah, I, I figured you yeah. might. Alright, well. I'll, I'll leave you to it then, shall I? And then we went off in search of the forest. Now, if I was an I'm innkeeper... So oh, well, there we go. My wings. If I was an innkeeper, I perhaps would be in the inn. The Inglenook Inn, as a matter of fact. Hello. You must be the traveler from the wrecked ship. A cave dweller rescued me. Oh, good. Ingolf needs some visitors every now and then. I wish he would spend more time in town, but he'd rather be alone. Do you live in Lindo? Yes, I run the inn. I always keep a full stock of soup and tea to refresh weary travelers. Well, that's very kind when of I you. When I was young, I traveled all over this island. I'd love to adventure again one day. Um, I'd love to talk about a lot of things, but, uh, Essen, I think he really needs you. Oh, of course he does. And what is it this time? Well, he's got a jug stuck on his head. Again? That's like the eighth time. All right, then, we'd better go help. Okay. Eighth time. Really stuck, isn't it? Yeah, it's pretty stuck. Got a I hammer? I think what we need here is some soap. Would you be a dear and fetch some soap from Amin's house? It's just down the stairs and across the courtyard. Sure, but you know, I got an easel. I could give it a good swing from the side. Have that sucker off in a jiffy. Down the courtyard. And maybe here? Hi there. Complete stranger here. Hello there. Can I help you, traveler? You quite possibly could. I mean, could I borrow some soap? Soap? Well, certainly. May I ask why? Well, there's this fellow named Essen, and his head is currently stuck in a jug. He did? Hmm. Is he a friend of yours? Uh, no, I just, uh, barely know him. Ah, well, I shouldn't gossip then. Oh, you know what? Just between us, what's the dirt? He's just such a peculiar man. And you know what? I think Lenny is going to have some real issues when he grows up. Why is that? Well, you've seen him. The boy 
is unhinged. And not just that. I've been hearing a lot of yelling coming from that house. I think it's quite a broken home. You know, I imagine you'll be traveling all around this island, being a tourist and all. Perhaps when you get to Nova, you should let the sheriff know about Isan. I think it's only right, you know, for Lenny. Um, I'll consider it. I think it'd be best for the child. I only have his best interest at heart. Isan is not a stable man, and wholly unsuitable to be a parent. Here, this will help you with the toll. Right, well, here's some soap. Safe travels. Alrighty, thank you, and... Um... I... I kinda... Think you're somewhere between an owl and a spider. Anyway, off I go. That took a darker turn than I was expecting. I'm not convinced the guy's unhinged just because he gets his head stuck in jars. I mean, you know, it's a jug. Who do we give this to? Do I give this to you? You have the soap. Well, let's try this thing then. Here, let me have that soap. Here you go. Well, I guess it was convenient that you dropped in when you did. Thanks for getting Nika. Um, just out of curiosity, how'd you get your head stuck? Well, you are a nosy tourist, aren't you? Beeswax! Um... Okay. I did just help you, though, but okay, I gotta ask now, because you said beeswax. Imine said she heard yelling from your house. I mean? That nosy, stuck-up, goody, two-talon... Ah. If you had to deal with what I have to deal with... She just doesn't like me because I'm not posh like her. This whole town is stuck up. Them and all their judging eyes. You know what? Get out of my house. You're just like everyone else in this town. Coming in here and telling me I'm a bad father? Get out! Hey man, I didn't tell you were a bad father. I know that's what you meant. Just get out! Wow. Okay. Well, I... I didn't expect any of that. There you go. i just stick to painting. I saw you talking with the captain. How is she doing? Oh, you know, she really loved that ship. I don't think I've heard her talk about much else. Hmm, I wonder if she'll ever recover. How have you been? Oh, you know... Lindo's an interesting place. After that wreck, I may just settle down here for a while. Alright, you take care, Aaliyah. At least the chickens seem reasonable. Hi! Ah, a newcomer. In the future, if you're ever in need of carriage to Nava, I'm your driver. Well, thanks, Tifa. But I think I'd like to look around a My bit first. My ox is strong, no? Strong like ox, smart like tractor. Oh, but you have kitties, so it's okay. What do we have here? Things. And all of a sudden, Checkers the Khajiit comes to visit. Because feathers and cats. So this is East Shade. As I said, it's self-described as an open world adventure game. It feels to me a bit like an RPG about being a painter, but... Not really so much on the stats, so I guess adventure game is a good enough term. Although the locals can be gruff, it seems quite charming, very pretty. Interesting to explore. What is this? Looks like a toll for the bridge? Maybe? 
I don't know how much coin I've got in the form of glowstone, so 15. Oops. Let's check on the fisherman here. Well, I be a newcomer, are you? Trying to get across the bridge, I guess. I hope you've got the glowstones for it. It's not free, you know. The rule is you pay once and you can use it as much as you'd like. Oh. Where can I get glowstones? From other people, I think. It seems to me that you're in need of some money. What's all that you're carrying? Looks heavy. Are you some kind of painter? Yes, I am. Mm. You know what? Maybe there's a way you can get the glowstones out of me after all. Yeah? There's a gazebo in Lindau. Real pretty spot. Maybe you've been there. Anyway, I'd like a painting of that view. I'll paint it for the you. The gazebo is easy to find. It's just behind the inn. And I want the painting from the gazebo, not of the gazebo. It's the view, not the building, if you get my meaning. Damn fish aren't biting sure. today. All right, let's go try and make a painting. Got a feather. Looks like coal or charcoal. I'm going the right way, right? Yep, that's the bridge. So yeah, it looks like a, a nice change of pace from other things. Nothing seems to be trying to eat us. Or kill us, and we don't seem to be required of killing anyone either. Reminds me of the good old days when people made games about just about anything. There I go, showing my age once more. Let's find a beautiful view from this gazebo. It got slow for a second there. Oh, well. Great viewpoint, isn't it? Oh, hello there. Lovely. Look, the eclipse is starting. Really? Where? Oh. Wow. Am I allowed to uh, paint here? No, I don't feel like I am. Not a bad show, right? Not at all, Nika. It's been quite a while since I've really watched it. I try to come up here every day. I guess it just doesn't get old for me. Anyway, if you haven't got lodging for the night, feel free to stay at the inn. I'll leave the upstairs room unlocked for you. Drop in at your leisure. Well, thank you, Nika. <laughs> Don't worry about payment. Shipwreck survivors stay free of charge. Thank you so much. Take care now. You too. Well, I think I still want to paint our ships. Let's get a little bit of gazebo in frame here. Maybe something like this. Or do we want to just go all out? I don't know. I think all out. So, how was that now? Um. Oh, we need to make another one? Oh, we need wood. We need wood still. I don't want to paint over my first painting of a kitty cat. That would be unacceptable. So let's see if we can find some loose wood. Okay, let's get out of the flower bed. That was a bad move. Oh, we haven't gone up here. 
think that's the gazebo he wanted. The one behind the inn, he said. Aha! Some more canvas. More canvas. A book! Once an old lady went up into a tall tower right on the coast. She stayed up there watching the ocean and eating snacks until it was past her bedtime. Then she wanted to go home to see her cat. She started to go down the stairs, but she fell because she was so tired. Then she died. She turned into a ghost, and now she stays in the tower and haunts it. She turns on the lights whenever night comes so that her cat can find her. But the cat doesn't ever go because the tower is too scary. The end. Okay. Well, that's, uh, again, just a little dark. Just a little. A fascinating juxtaposition to the overall beauty of the place. But we are determined to make at least one more painting before we retire. Our look at East Shade. So. Off we go. Every once in a while I slow down, I feel like there's a stamina system that I'm not aware of. Okay. Oh, wait. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Now... There we go. I think that's our shot right there. Okay, let's see if our fisherman is happy with our art. And then maybe we will head back to the inn and conclude our journey. Okay. And... Well, looky here, you've gone and painted the gazebo view. Are you willing to sell it? Sure. Well, how about that? Got myself something fancy. You have fun with your new painting. I am... See you around. And we have now, what, 40 of these glowstones. Let's see what the toll is for the bridge. 60. Okay, well. I guess we will be very grateful that Nika is letting us stay at the inn for free. This is East Shade. I found it on Steam. It was, I think, 15% off. And if you're looking for something a bit relaxing, something without 
things apparently I'm trying to eat you, left, I'm right, and it. center. Get down from there. It might be. I can't fly if I don't even try. Oh no 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 no. You're not a bird, Lenny. No. You need to come down right now. You can do anything you put your mind to, but uh, wings You're help. You're going to get hurt. Oh, Everybody, boy. turn around. What? Why? If you don't all turn right now, I'm gonna jump. Okay. Okay, okay. Everyone, turn around. I don't know what you're trying to do, but it's time to come down now. Thanks again for the canvas. I flew! Sure. I can't believe it. I flew. Of course you did. I'm just glad you're back down. Don't do that again, okay? Okay. Well. Okay. You go, kid. Well, Sorry for the. Uh, I won't Sorry for the doubting there. Right on. All right. Once again, this has been Checkers with our look here at East Shade. A somewhat relaxing, somewhat surprising open world adventure. Where you play a painter. I would like to say thank you for watching. I hope you found the video entertaining and maybe even just a little informative. I would like to invite you to subscribe. Thank you kindly if you are already subscribed. I'd also like to invite you to like and a share if you so desire. Most of all, though, I would like to ask you to please, please take care. <laughs>